Road trip, baby. I think I might have trod in dog poo. Oh! I'm coming! I've got a baby growing inside me, and I don't have a toilet. Hey, yeah, mate. <laughs> Here we are, fresh grow away. And then that just, little flush. Unbelievable scenes. Nobody walk around the front, or you'll see me taking a. Road trip, baby. So after an awesome, how long has it been? Four days at this YouTube Camp Creator event. It's time to head on out of here and head out into the countryside. I hope anyway. I'm off to a place called the Y Valley and I'll introduce you to some of the people that I'm going with later on in the video. There's no agenda, no plan for today. Just head out, drive, maybe find somewhere to swim because it's still about 30 degrees today. And then tonight we're gonna try and do a four people stealth camp. But as always, no idea where we're gonna end up. We're about to hit the road. We got Charlie and Lauren over there. We got Lou there. And we got Tash behind us. So apparently I'm lead driver. Hey, oi! <laughs> Gotta stop talking and get on the road. <laughs> I think I might have trod in dog poo. Because it stinks in here at the moment. Hey, tranquilo, my friend, tranquilo, huh? Oh! I got my pants and socks flying behind me everywhere. Beautiful, what a day for it, baby! What a day! Now I'm realizing why I was told to go first. Because I'm the tester. Lou mentioned that these roads were narrow, and they are. God almighty. Oh shit. Oh no, oh god, how's this gonna work? Oh yeah, she's in Columba. We got a bit of a traffic jam down there. Cheers. How's this gonna work then? Oh fuck me, have I cocked this one up or what? Can she get round or not? Can you go in there? Hey? Oh, this is a bloody nightmare. Oh, I mean, how am I even gonna squeeze here? What is going on? I'm not gonna... This one, mate. No worries. Come on! Come on, you f Sorry. Come on, because there's no cars coming. Ooh, right, no mucking about, let's go for it. Please don't meet another car in the middle down this road. Lou! You bastard, you should have gone first, not me! Come in! I'm coming! This road is only wide enough for one vehicle, and there's a few little parking areas to pull in, but not a lot it has to be said i'm coming i'm coming welcome 
to Simmons Yat East. If that means anything to you or you know where it is, it looks like a nice spot. Right, here comes the fun part. Having a van this big is not easy to park. Do you think we can go in there? Oh, I'm gonna scorch it as well. Yeah, I mean, I would, but I don't think Mum would. Oh, God. There, so. I found somewhere to park. My blood pressure is so high right now. Oh, God. God almighty. Hopefully, that's not smashed the door or anything. Oh, God. You parking up? What are you saying about this? All right. Here we go. Good to see ya. Here's Lou coming. This is the problem. We've all got big vans. What a pain in the ass that was. We're chasing the water. Straight after this bridge. Jump in. Chill out and cool down. It's a lovely dip. Time to head back, grab some food. Loads of people out, just enjoying the weather, to be fair, and having a swim. That was so refreshing. But even a few minutes back in the sun and it's scorching again. We're all back at the van, trying to figure out somewhere to stay tonight. This is the life of professionals. We're using park for, <laughs> park for night to try and figure out where to stay. What we got going That's on there? I'll show you. This is van life at its finest, isn't it? Oh yeah, absolutely. There's my phone. Park for night's the way forward. Park for night, you need to contact all of us <laughs> and, give, and give us some sort of sponsorship. This is the app all of us use to try and find places to stay. This is the one you guys use the most, yeah, isn't park, it? Yeah, Park for night's like a go-to. Yeah, me the same, you the same. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you, Tash? What's that? You always use Park for night. Yeah, use Park for night. John sometimes just goes on Google Maps. Yeah, Google yeah. Maps. But I've always got one. Park But why Google Maps? Then you've got to... Just to look for spaces that might not be on park for nights so if uh, he finds yeah, a space yeah. that he thinks we can get into. The super yeah. stealth ones. Yeah, that's it, yeah. Well, as stealth as you can be in a, in yeah, a May yeah. class. True, but, true. Um, uh, but yeah, no, park for nights always my backup, 100%. This is the life, setting up shots, stop the van, run back, get the camera. Ew, tossa. <laughs> Thank you, let's go people. Oh. She's gonna have to go back. My solar panels have been just scratched off the roof, I think. God almighty. Right, we've just rocked up to the car park. Not where we were going to be staying tonight because there was a sign as we were coming in saying that no overnight parking and the gates are going to be closing at nine o'clock. So we're going to go for an evening stroll or afternoon, should I say. Ping the drone up, get a few pictures, get a few shots, chill out, enjoy each other's company. Because to be honest, I always do this kind of stuff alone, but it is really nice just to meet other people that are into the same thing as me. They've got vans and we can just chat everything van life. It, dip, dog. Let's go. <laughs> it's no Bali, it's no Thailand. It's no India, it's no Nepal, or Nepal, sorry, but it's England, and it's a bloody hell of a view. Look at this, Christ, I didn't even show you the best part. Look at that, that is stunning. That is obviously where we were earlier, but I have no idea which part of the river. 
that is an absolutely incredible view. I'm gonna get the drone up and let's get some cinematics on the go and scout this place out. that so far today I've really enjoyed myself it's so nice to be doing these kinds of things with other people and sharing those experiences and those memories not just for myself it very much especially today makes me feel like I'm back out traveling again and I'm excited for the future excited to get back out there in the van excited to meet like-minded individuals and just see where life takes us where are you going, love? Where is Lou going? Lou from Camper Vibe. She doesn't know how to indicate. Everybody, please go on her latest video and tell her she needs to go back to driving school. Oh, hey, Lou knows how to indicate. <laughs> This looks like a bloody perfect spot. Oh yeah, baby. Oh man. How good does this look? This is unreal. I'll show you it in a second. You coming in? We got Charlie and Lauren with some very, very dodgy parking. This is unreal, look at this. I know, right? Oh. <laughs> It's brilliant because Lou and Tash have travelled around Scotland, around Europe, and they've seen my face, Charlie and Lauren's face, and they're saying that when we go to Scotland or anywhere in the Europe, in, in the Alps, that views like this and park-ups like this are just standard, normalised. I'll tell you what, it makes a hell of a difference from Tesco, Sainsbury's, Ikea. I'll pick this spot all day long. We've all got some hungry stomachs now, and for some crazy, stupid reason, I'm on cooking duty. And as I said earlier, we've gone for fajitas. Hey, can't say I told you so. People love them, and so do I. So, Chef Will, on the go. We'll cook up some grub, get some food in the stomachs, enjoy the sunset when it goes down, and just chill out and have a nice evening. Because I haven't got a, uh, a fridge in my van, We've had to put all of the ingredients that need refrigerating in Lou's van. And by the way, what a bloody cool van this is. This has inspired me to basically copy them, to be honest. Some more washing for you, ladies. Oh, I'll just add it to the pile there. You Thank cheeky, you. Cheeky sausage. Bye bye. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Morning. Morning. What a place to wake up. Peaceful, tranquil. Perfect.
It was a sad day today because I'm going to be leaving the guys, heading back to London. Probably been on the road for about two weeks, staying at a few friends' houses, and then I went to the event, and then I've had a couple of days here with all these guys. And it's been bloody good fun, let me tell you. And hopefully, it's been fun to watch as well. It makes a bit of a change from the normal stealth camp and stuff. But this is the kind of stuff I want to get into more and just go out and have fun with new people, make new friends, live a few more adventures. And as always, obviously, take you guys along with me. Right, I've got a baby growing inside me because it's that time in the morning and I don't have a toilet. But thankfully, <laughs> the legends, Charlie Lauren, the toilet transfer, yeah. got to help a brother out. <laughs> Charlie's just, just done his business in his and now to make me feel more comfortable, he's put it in mine. So time to close all the doors, put the curtains back up. That's what friends are for. Yeah, exactly. Hey, hey, hey mate. <laughs> you know, fresh for away. What a legend. This is going to be the first time I've ever used anything like this. <laughs> I can't believe it. Don't forget to right. take you, will you? You're all going to have to walk away about 200 metres. <laughs> <laughs> all you got to do, look, that, that opens the hole. Yeah. So don't shit without shirt because it'll just stay there. Yeah. <laughs> that opens the don't hole. Don't leave us a shit. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, no. oh, 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 I just wouldn't say nothing. Oh, cheers, mate. <laughs> I, no, I saw no, that no, out. Just, you can't see anything down through it, can you? Well, yeah. like. Yeah. Yeah. When you've done, I'll have a look in it. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> yeah, literally, that's it. Look, there's all the shit and piss in there. Yeah, and you just pump that, and then that just little flush. Unbelievable scenes. Yeah. Nice. I need a few minutes to recompose myself now. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody walk round the front, or you'll see me taking a dump. Right. Do you want a shovel? A few moments later. <laughs> The deed is done, I'm feeling 10 stone lighter. But I think I've filled the bloody thing up. I think I was flushing too much. Charlie, I think I've, I think I used too much flush. Cause it's full. Oh, that's all right. Yeah, but is that normal? Yeah, probably. Yeah. So how many flushes did you do? Quite a few because yeah, I forgot, to try and get it down. I forgot to open it. Oh. <laughs> Morning dumps is the priority, mate. Well, cause now it's gone to red. It's all yeah, well, clean. Is it clean in there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that's all right. That will go down, look. No, oh, no, because there's space there. You can see space, oh, right? Okay. Yeah. Eventually, that toilet roll will go down. Yeah. But no, that's fine. We've got another pill or two in there, mate. Don't worry about that. <laughs> How was that for you, mate? Hell of an experience. I thought I bloody blocked the thing. Big <laughs> tick on Will's bucket list. <laughs> you can have it back now. No! <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Big weights early morning. Come on. The same like that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But depending on your build, you could get a bigger one. Yeah. Oh, yeah, and I would get a bigger one. Yeah, I would. On the boat, you got a massive one. Same as them. Oh, really? Yeah, it lasts us about two days. You're telling me you haven't got a bloody dishwasher? <laughs> <laughs> Absolute peasant. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> How you this van life stuff is not glamorous. Shitting in other people's port loose and now washing up in a bucket. <laughs> yeah, I'm a good woman. <laughs> You're coming in here for a bath after it. Yeah. <laughs> I actually need one to be fair. You want to wash your pits? <laughs> right, I'm the first one to leave this morning, as I said, to head back to London. But before I leave, obviously, firstly, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. What I want you to do if you will, is go and check out all of these guys' channels because not only are they all awesome people, but they all make amazing, awesome, fun videos. Who the heck is calling me? That was my dad, obviously. Anyway, as I was saying, go and check out all of these guys' channels. I'll leave a link to them in the description below. Go ahead, give them some banter, give them a subscribe, give them a like, and drop a comment on all of their videos saying, fajitas for life let's spam their comments it's been an awesome incredible last week last few days especially with these guys just getting to know other people in the same kind of field as me and there's going to be plenty more adventures to come with other people and also plenty more stealth camps and van builds also as now i feel a little bit more motivated to crack on with mine and get mine done especially get a fridge in there and get my own portaloo so i'm not having to borrow other people's thank you guys so much for watching as always i'll catch you in the next video